What is going on YouTube family and welcome to another video. Seeing as how we are growing so rapidly and just spreading Africa across the world and spreading positivity, a lot of questions have been coming up and I thought this might be a perfect time to do another question and answers. We haven't prepared anything, I've just got about 12 or so questions that keep on coming up and are very, very commonly occurring and I thought why not me just try and answer them to the best of my ability to help you guys out. If there's something you feel I haven't touched on or you'd like to know about, just leave a comment down below what you guys would like to hear and I'll try and answer it and let you guys know. So the first question is what nationality I am. I am South African, absolutely born and bred. And yeah, I'm not Ghanaian even though a lot of people do think I am Ghanaian. My family live in Ghana, I absolutely love it there. And that's why I push Ghana so much. But I really love to show the positivity in Africa and try and help change the narrative because there's so much positive going on and a lot of people only focus on the negatives. Next, bro, you deserve a Ghana Tourism Award. You teach me more about my home than I see on the news. Thank you so much. I truly, truly appreciate that. That's my main goal. My main goal is to just keep on showing positivity, showing how every country there's so much positive going on. We need to stop looking at the negative and just focus on the positive and just keep on growing together and getting better together and improving little by little every single day so everyone can achieve their goals. So that's basically what my channel is all about. Plans to travel across Ghana. This is actually super, super cool that this actually came up because people want me to visit different regions and I'll probably go into more depth about this, but I want to take like a two to three week trip where I get a car, some sponsors want to jump on, I can throw some sponsors on the car and I just travel Ghana. Like I'll go all the way down the coast, all the way up to the north, travel Kamasi, travel all the way down the Gold Coast. I would absolutely love that. Meet all people along the way, meet subscribers along the way and really just engage with everyone. The next on that list is my favorite African country. Now, this is very, very obvious. My favorite African country is going to be Ghana. You guys know that <laughs> my cat decided to join me for the video. You guys know that I absolutely love Ghana. I push Ghana and it is a country that I absolutely love. I love the spirit. I love the vibe. I love the community that you get when you're there. And that is why I love Ghana so much. So that would definitely be my favorite African country. Do you want to build a house? I don't know if they're meaning in Ghana because of my previous video or they just mean overall but I would love to build a house. I would love to actually do in a couple years time maybe do a series even on YouTube where I go through the whole process of me acquiring land, getting all the building materials and building a house from scratch in Ghana. I think it would be absolutely incredible and a process I would love and I would love to actually document for everyone to see. Next on the list is how has life been under lockdown? I think it's been pretty well considering. I know a lot of people's families have been negatively affected by this, especially with the loss of jobs, the loss of income, loss of revenue, what makes it really, really hard. But so far, my family's been keeping safe. We've been keeping healthy. The golf courses are open. So that's pretty much what I've been doing. Gyms are still closed. Doing some home gyms, still doing some of my university work, reading some articles, and then just staying safe and keeping healthy and just trying to keep a positive outlook on everything. Next questions. Do you know when the borders will reopen? I did touch on this in my previous video. I do not know when the borders are going to be open. As soon as I hear anything or see anything, you all will be the very, very first to know. I'll put a video together and let everyone know how they can get in, what carriers are busy taking people to Ghana, what are the procedures to get into Ghana, do you have to get testing, absolutely everything. I will do a video completely in that entirety. But as of now, the borders are still closed unless you are a Ghanaian or Ghanaian citizen. Are you single? Question mark, marry me. I am currently single. I am got so much stuff going on in my life right now. That's all I'm focusing on. Just try and build the next couple of years and really put a solid foundation that I can then use for the rest of my career when I decide to start uh, building a family. How's my family doing? Thank you so much for asking. I really appreciate it. My family is doing really, really well. Just keeping safe, keeping busy. And so for everyone's safe, everyone's healthy. So that's what I'm very, very grateful for every single morning I wake up in the morning that my family's all well. Sorry, this cat is just, it's a little bit of a princess and absolutely loves attention. Next on the list, please show some more beautiful places in South Africa. I would love to, I'm so far planning. Obviously with lockdown, it makes it very hard because all the national parks, all the really cool things that I would love to show, the botanical gardens, like certain areas on the beachfront, the hotels, the houses, it makes it all very, very difficult to do right now due to all the restrictions, all the laws, what you've got to abide by, I don't want to get arrested. So that does make it very, very hard. Do you have Instagram? Yes, I'd absolutely appreciate it so much if you guys are going to give me a follow on Instagram. It's always the very, very first link in the description box down below. 
If you guys like my content on YouTube and want to share my Instagram page to help me gain some traction, all you do is if it's in your story, just tag me in it. I'll repost it and give you guys some love back. So I'd really appreciate it. So if you're not in the description box or just Callan Wesley on Instagram and go and give me a follow and I try and reply to every single message. I still have about 40 odd unread because I get a lot, a lot, a lot, but I love engaging. I love talking to people and I love learning their stories and all of that. So it's absolutely awesome. The next one, it's, I presume it was on my video about being demonetized. It says, why do you not have a PayPal or patron, patron account? I just don't want to be a person that is saying that Here's, here's details, put money in it to support me. Even though I have nothing against it, I just feel I'd rather bring out a product where instead of making that couple of dollars, I could tell, say, a t-shirt or sell certain types of merchandise that promote me, promote my channel, but then you guys are getting something in return, not just asking people blatantly for money. So that's just my point of view. I have nothing against people that do it. You gotta, you gotta find out what works for you. Just right now, for me, I don't wanna put a price on it because it's just, it's just something I don't agree with personally. But like I said, and I think that's all the questions. So like I said, if there's something that I haven't touched on, just leave it in the comment section below and I'll definitely get back to you guys and girls. And I just want to say thank you so much for your ongoing support. I really, really appreciate it. I know it's super hard because my main audience is in Ghana and I can't get to Ghana to do daily vlogs. So I'm doing the best I can. Thank you guys so much for staying with me. Smash that subscribe button so we can grow together, get better together and improve little by little every single day to keep on spreading Africa to the world.